Hi, this is Andrew with PandaComputers.com, and welcome to our video series on Windows XP. We are talking about quick tips today, and this is a quick tip on toolbars in Firefox. Now, I'm going to go ahead and double-click my Firefox right here, and it's an Internet browser. We already did a video on Internet Explorer, so if you don't use Firefox, watch the other video. What's a toolbar? These are toolbars up in here. Here's the menu toolbar, here's my Norton toolbar, and there's a lot of other ones out there that are very common. Ask toolbars, a lot toolbars, all these things that get installed. Most of the time they get installed by accident or they get thrown in with another program or some service you sign up for or download. And you end up with like five, six, seven, eight of them here and you go, well, how do I get rid of these things? Quite simple. There's two ways to do it for Internet Firefox. Number one, is we can go right up here to the top, near the top here, to see this little gray area here? We can do a right click and we can say customize or we can just uncheck here. Now I don't like this little Norton toolbar here. I don't use it. Safe web and identity safe is for people that want to keep all their stuff safe going online and everything else like that. See now it shows the bookmark toolbar, the navigation and the menu bar. This is the bit menu bar. This navigation bar is this one right here and the bookmark bar is the one up here that works for bookmark. Now simply all I have to do is uncheck the Norton one and see it went away. Now see here most valued and everything like that. I don't really need that bar there. I just go up here again and the bookmark bar and it goes away. Boom. Clean, simple. If it's a toolbar you didn't want to install or it didn't want to be there or it got tricked in putting it in some other program you downloaded, you have to go to start settings, control panel, add and remove programs, It'll find it in the list and uninstall it. It's that simple. Now, why do I not want toolbars? Well, first of all, you get five or six or seven of them. They take a lot of space up here, and you lose a lot of the area of your desktop. Uh, or your, not your desktop, but your browser there. You can't see as much on the Internet. The second thing is, every one of those toolbars is connecting to 12 to 14 different websites. So it puts a whole huge load of memory and CPU cycles away from your computer. You keep hearing me talk about memory and CPU cycles. The more it takes away, the more you can't use. It makes your computer slow and cumbersome. It makes your internet slow. Keep it simple. Keep it quick. Have a great day.